Hello everyone, and welcome back to Alba, a wildlife adventure. We're continuing right where we left off, so we need to make our way down to the nature reserve in order to hear what the mayor has to say. Of course, I'm going to want to take a picture of every single little animal along the way, because why wouldn't I? Um, so let's, let's continue exploring around. This is a bad picture. I said I wasn't going to take those. We were going to try and get good pictures. But we've got a rabbit here. Oh, that's a good picture. There. There's our good picture. And you can look all these up in here, by the way. Since um, I haven't been showing it much. And it also keeps track of how many animals you've seen uh, in total and from different uh, areas. Just so that you can kind of track where you still need to find animals. There are definitely some animals that uh, you can't find till certain parts of the story. So I wouldn't go around looking for all of them right at the beginning. Of course, looking around for the ones you can find at the beginning is fun. Let's clean up some trash. Why would you throw trash near the bin? Just throw it in the bin. All right. So we'll take a roundabout route to the nature reserve to hear what the uh, well that is a picture of its face. It's not a picture of much else. Somehow the app can identify it. A real app would not be able to identify based on that. Here's another one. There's a better picture. Just because I said I would take good pictures, so I'll try. Alright, I don't want to get too wayward in my trek to the nature reserve. We found Elena, who's doing some yoga. So there are a few island residents you can run into on uh, just about every day. And they might be doing different stuff, or at least be in different locations every day. So... But there's also like some extra stuff you can do on a lot of days, so it's good to look around. You don't really want to miss uh, like side quests, essentially, is what they are. Um, I know this game doesn't feel like a game that would have side quests, but it totally can and does a little bit. Alright, this is a seagull. But you know what? We haven't scanned a seagull. I know we're going to see about a million seagulls after this, but... Now we have one in our phone. This beach is covered in trash. We can't talk to anybody on it. But we can talk to this guy, Emilio. I love living on an island. You're never more than a few minutes from a beach. It's true. At least on this island. There are definitely islands where that's probably not true. I guess also depends how big can an island be before it's not an island. Is Australia an island? It's pretty much an island. It's a really big island. <laughs> Alright, Juanito. Hello, who? Oh, um, I, I know who, I mean, I know who you are. From the newspapers. I'm Juan. I'm Juanito. The mayor's gonna make a big speech today. I hope he's finally gonna sort out the nature reserve. Sorry. Um, you see there was a fire there last year. And the whole place has gotten damaged. And the mayor has done nothing about it since. But it's real. It's still really nice. We are could go play there sometime. So Juanita seems very passionate about the nature reserve. You can tune the radio to a different uh, station. You can have it play to your liking. Unfortunately, it has a very limited range. Like, can't really hear it anyway. But you know, we we tried really hard to customize our music. Erica. Oh, hello. You must be Alba. I'm Erica. Maria is always so busy on the week of the summer festival. This is the last day off she's going to get until it's over. I'm just glad it's such a beautiful day for us to enjoy together. Maria. Hola, Alba. Maybe you remember me from last year. I'm Maria. I helped your abuelo Vincent fix his scooter. Marina. That thing's a menace. Socks barks every time it goes past. Anyway, I hope you have a great summer here. 
and Marina. Buenos dias, Alba. Good job saving the dolphin. You and Inez are the talk of the town. Maybe you remember us. I'm Marina, and this little fluff ball is socks. We briefly met a few years ago at the ice cream shop. You were with your grandma. We always talk gossip, her and I. Anyway, I'm sure we'll see you around. Enjoy your stay. Hi, socks. Look at the little cutie. Alright. So I've not seen anybody else. We didn't really look through town. We can go back, um, but the nature reserve's up here. And I would like to, you know, advance our story a little bit. Alba, over here, we're curious what the mayor's gonna say. Maybe he'll announce the restoration of the nature reserve, you know, after the fire last winter nearly destroyed it. Grandma, whew, we got here just in time. And restoration would be fantastic. The nature reserve's been abandoned for far too long. True debt. Every year, Alba and I have been wanting to play here. Remember, Bonica, we used to come here when you were a toddler. Your granddad told me you even saw a lynx. A lynx! So jealous! Yes, the king of the forest. We saw it right here in the nature reserve. Like, so, so jealous. I want to see a lynx, too. Hey, I think the mayor's about to start. Let's go see. People of Sekerol, says the mayor. I have exciting news about the nature reserve. We're going to transform it into... <laughs> Hotel Delusion. The world's largest luxury hotel. I'm sure you all know the nature reserve is sadly beyond saving, but this new hotel will breathe new life into our wonderful island. Tourism will be back together with new jobs and opportunities. Please give a warm welcome to Paco, the man behind the hotel. Thank you, Tony. My vision for the hotel is all about luxury, comfort, and opportunity. Not even the sky is the limit, because there are no limits. My company will build the hotel in record time. In fact, we've already started construction. Thank you, Paco, for your inspiring words. This concludes the announcement. Thank you all for coming. We will take no questions. That's how you know that it is a popular decision when they don't want questions. A what now? A luxury hotel? Hmm, interesting. Nature reserve beyond saving. We'll see about that. Alba, let's investigate at once. Let's talk to everybody. Grandma, tearing down the nature reserve? Building a luxury hotel? What sort of nightmare have I woken up to? I demand a refund. Granddad, hmm, shame about the nature reserve, but over the years we've gone from a bustling tourist hotspot to a ghost town with more businesses closing every week. So maybe the luxury hotel's a good thing. Hmm, difficult. Alia, well that was unexpected. Indeed, it's going to put our island on the map again. Hmm. True, but there are other ways. Some that don't involve pouring concrete into a nature reserve. I wonder if only personal trainers for the hotel's gym could be a great chance for me to expand my business. But what if they bring their own staff from the mainland? That could put me out of business. So many things to consider. Gong. My family moved here because it was so quiet. Now at the big hotel, this island could change. Natalia, maybe that's good? You can have too much quiet. I mean, look at this poster. I don't really want to. The mayor's gone off, so we just need to explore the nature reserve with Inez. So let's go ahead and head in. We'll see what we can see. There's probably some new animals in there for us to photograph. So excited. And trash to clean up. People be littering. Beyond saving, just needs a bit of tidying and fixing. Now the mayor's gonna build a hotel? No way. The Irol. You need a better name. The I Irol. Irol. I'm gonna call it Irol. I think. We'll act. Alba, we're gonna save the nature reserve. Let's start with cleaning up this mess. Yes. Yes, the ducks appreciate our valiant efforts. Worry not, feathered friends. The Irol's got this. Let's keep going, Alba. Going to remind people how nice this place is. So we can always oh, sell our, our bird feed. So we can fill the feeder and have the birds come. So we'll put the trash can back upright. 
And we've got some more ducks coming in. Hello, duck friends. Look, huge birds with green heads. Never seen them before. Alba, find out what they are with your app. Yes, let's go. This is not the place to pull out the app. Let's start with this. Duck. Duck friend. Alright. So we've reached our 12 animals, apparently. Next is 20. Come on, I want a good photo. That's a pretty good one. At least he's half facing us. No, three in the shot. Alright. Nine of these have duck in their name. <laughs> Rare shovelers spotted in nature reserve. Clara, shovelers, finally. I've been looking all over for them. Greetings, fellow nature enthusiasts. What's your name? Greetings to you, young friends. I'm Clara, president of the Wildlife Association. Our goal is to document all the creatures on this island. That's awesome. We've got our own wildlife rescue league, the IRAL. Current mission, rescue the nature reserve. Stop the hotel. Join us. I like this idea. My colleague Alba Singh here is, has all the paperwork ready. Right, Alba? We have no paperwork. Very funny, Alba. Now I have a clipboard. Very professional. Of course I'll sign up. The great idea, collecting signatures to stop the hotel. So we're starting a petition. Yes, that's um, exactly what our plan is and always was. We're going to need lots of signatures, like five million. Five million? I'd say 50 signatures should do it. I'm going to still find plenty of opportunities to get those. In fact, you and a colleague of mine is looking for sparrow hawks. Apparently they're nesting in the woods near town. Find and scan a sparrow hawk, that'll get you a signature for sure. Excellent. Thanks, fellow RL member. Sparrow hawk and signatures, here we come. Alright, we still need a picture of that one duck. This one. We've not seen it. We've not scanned this one with the very colorful face. Alright, a teal. None of that bird is teal. Just saying. Alright, so we can actually um, restore these signs. So, you just have to put new photos with the labels on them. So I don't believe we've seen this little guy yet, because we have pictures of everything that we've seen, but I don't think we have that one. But now it's on our to-do list because we've started it. Um, we can't do much more. I guess we didn't officially look at it, but the bridge is out. There's a little interaction mark. The bridge? All the best stuff's on the other side. Tomorrow I'm going to investigate who can help us fix the bridge. So we're gonna we're gonna save this nature reserve. Who's with me? Let me know in the comments. I really hope you're enjoying this game so far. I fell in love with it as soon as I started playing it. I played it in about two days, like start to finish. The only thing I don't have is all the animals in my own save file. Um. this little fella. Now come back. It's a cat. They're skittish, these cats. We'll try and get a good picture of one. Oh no, broken down birdhouse. Can't do anything about it right now, though. Yep, this suspicious goo is everywhere. Gotta follow the trail and find out where it leads. So we are not fans of this goo. Let me tell you. Alright, we found Pepe. Beth, you're both here on official hour world business. Oh hey, if you're going to be exploring the woods around here, watch where you're treading. There's puddles of nasty green goo all over the place. Almost put me off my lunch when I stepped in one earlier. Almost. Let's get some more birds in. 
believe we have these birds already scanned, but let's just make sure. Oh, no, we don't. We're, like, underneath them, which is kind of awkward, but... Alright, we have them now. Alright, let's get back to following this skill. Don't want to step in it, though. That seems icky. Oh no, an animal! Oh no, the squirrel's been drinking the weird gooey stuff. We've got to get help. Go find the vet in town, Alba. I'll keep an eye on your little friend. Alright. Luckily, we're very near town. Are you a vet? No. Eli gave me all these oranges. I only asked for a few to make one cake. The more the merry, I say, can never have too many cakes. Don't worry, dear. I'll give the oranges a really good wash. More laundry we can take down. Always gotta take down all the laundry. Oh, here's the mayor and this dude. So you're the one tidying up the nature reserve. You do realize we're gonna tear it all down soon. Paco, don't upset the little girl. Now how much for a helipad? Ah, hello. So you're the little girl who helped save the dolphin. I'm in the middle of an important business meeting, but perhaps we'll see you again. Enjoy your stay in Sekarol. Now then, as I was saying, we could add five more floors. I'm not a fan of this plan. A wildlife rescue league sounds like a good idea. <gasps> Veterinary clinic. Simone. Hola, I'm Simone, the vet. You're Alba from the newspaper. A sick squirrel? Of course I'll help. Let's go. Alright, we found the vet. Is there anyone else to talk to? There is. There's a police officer. Laura. Hello, you must be Alba, Vincent and Am Amalia's granddaughter. My name's Laura. I'm the only police officer in Sekerl. Luckily, there's not much crime here. Are you going to cause any trouble? Yes. Don't let me catch you then. Just kidding. Have fun and stay safe. I wanted to know what she would say if you said yes, because in my first playthrough I said no. Alright, let's go back and find that squirrel. It's over here. Right. Right, right, right. Ah, there's our patient. Let me have a look. Hmm, this is not good. Our squirrel friend was poisoned. Let me help you, little one. I'm going to take some samples so I can run some tests. In the meantime, brave adventurers, I need your assistance. I'm pretty sure I saw other sick animals nearby. Take this first aid kit and help them. Of course, we got this. Go for it, Alba. The animals need help. Oh my goodness. So many animals already in need of help. So we do have our next adventure that we uh, are going to set out on, but I think we'll start that in the next episode. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Pegasus, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!